Hey, 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 hi, everybody. I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you're all smiling and enjoying your lovely day. In this following tutorial, I'll be showing you on how to replicate VC Face's tracking loss inside of Waterdo. So, for those who have migrated from VC Face to Waterdo and prefer the tracking loss VC Face had, we can set that up all in Waterdo and it should be pretty much about one to one. So, you're going to go into the blueprints tab right here. This is regardless if you are an iFacial mocap user or media pipe user. I would not recommend you setting this up if you're a full body mocap user though, because it would just look kind of awkward. So for iFacial mocap and same applies to media pipe, which I'll show that. iFacial mocap, there are three different nodes you have to keep in mind. There's a switch float here, the switch blend shape list here, and then the switch rotation list. So rotation, blend shape, position those are the three you have to keep in mind about and all you're just gonna do is that under the part that says two false transition time and the delay right here you're gonna set these two to pretty high numbers so let's just say nine 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 you can put like four nines here if you want to spam more you can although I, I wouldn't do it too much though but yeah, just put it to this exact number just to keep it simple no need to spam it too much to overwhelm water dough so do that, do that, and then do the same thing over here to the switch float here. Do that and do that. And then uh, you'll notice that when you start, let's say you're moving around and stuff and you cover the camera, you'll notice that your avatar actually now properly pauses. There's also one more thing to keep in mind about is that when you rotate the camera, you'll notice that your character is still kind of looking at the camera we don't want this vc face does not do this so in order to get rid of that you're gonna find the other node here that says character look at target looks like this and you're going to press on the enabled here so you're gonna say no to disable it and then once you do the thing here you'll notice that your character doesn't do that anymore so it looks much you know like vc face pretty much so there you go that's pretty much how you do it for iFacial mocap. And again, you can apply the same knowledge to media pipe. But in case you uh, are struggling on navigating media pipe, let me show you how to do that. So for media pipe users, you're going to go into the media pipe face tracking blueprint here. Again, same rule. There is a switch float here. There is the switch blend shape list here and then the rotation list. Same thing. So on the false sliders right here, set this to 9999. 9999 and then set this one also to nines all the nines yep so for rotation blend shape and then all the way over here as well for the positioning and then like i mentioned before disable the look at target right here by clicking on no and then should work just the same way again it's a pretty much the same layout and there you go that's how you were able to now have vc faces tracking loss by wadi though so i hope that this tutorial helps you out and again let me know if you have any questions but do join the wadi do discord server if you have multiple questions since the wadi do community is there to help you out in learning this program otherwise i hope you have a lovely day and i'll see you guys next time bye bye